Hey guys, we're here. We just checked in. We are in Laughlin, Nevada. Let's go check out our room. Hope you guys liked our room tour and we are starving because we just did a five hour drive from San Diego. So we are gonna get something to eat right now. Let's go. We just had some delicious in and out and we're from San Diego. So we have in and out over there, but for some reason we wanted to hear. We were just hungry. <laughs> we were Definitely just hungry. hungry. We had a five uh, hour drive. And we just wanted to eat real quick, but as uh, usual, it was packed. Yes, very, very packed. So now we are gonna check out the river walk, and also we're gonna see if we could hop on one of these little uh, river taxis or what do they call water taxis. Water we're gonna taxis. jump on a water taxi, and then we're gonna check out the Colorado River. So we're in Laughlin, Nevada, and if you go on the other side of the river, it turns into Arizona. So if you're interested in getting the water taxis, it's $5 one way and it stops off at every hotel. So if you want to go back, it's going to be $10, but you could go all the way from one side all the way to the other side for five bucks. So it's a pretty good deal and it's a nice little fun ride. Come here to Riverside Hotel and Casino and check out this amazing car show. Admission is $2 per adult over 21 years of age and most of these cars are actually owned by Mr. Laughlin and some of them are owned by Mr. Lopez which uh, actually has a couple shops across the river in Bullhead, Arizona. If you're looking for things to do here in Laughlin, Nevada, come to the car show here at the Riverside hotel and casino owned by Mr. Laughlin. Third floor. Okay, just a quick tip. If you guys want to drink while you are enjoying the sunset in the river walk, okay, you're allowed to, but don't bring any glass bottles, any glass cups. No glass. You will get arrested. <laughs> no, maybe fine. Fine. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Today is day two in Laughlin, Nevada, and we had a blast last night. Uh, we checked out a little bit of the nightlife. We went dancing. <laughs> fun but it is not comparable to Vegas so if you're looking for that party style over in Vegas do not come to Laughlin we still had a blast and a great time though we also went gambling for a little bit last night uh, hit the slot machines up and we also played Kino and if you're wondering yes the waitresses do come around and they give you free drinks as long as you're gambling just like in Vegas. I'd say the overall feel here is more like downtown Vegas but it's still a couple notches below so 
Don't come here thinking it's like Vegas or like downtown Vegas. It's more of a relaxed atmosphere where you could gamble, you could still drink, and you could have fun. If you're a coffee drinker and you need coffee in the morning like I do, there is a Dunkin' Donuts here at Edgewater Casino where we're staying at. And if you want Starbucks, that's at the Golden Nugget, a couple hotels down. Food's ready. We are here at the Laughlin Outlet Center and we kind of came early because we have a lot of stores that are closed. So do not come before 10 o'clock. So the food court is downstairs on the first floor. I'm gonna show the directory so you guys can check out what stores they have here, but they do have a lot of stores here. And if you're looking for the outlet, it's located right in front of the Edgewater Casino where we're staying at. scrambled egg and a biscuit. Fried chicken, baked chicken, mashed potato gravy, and roasted turkey. So there was a long line to get in, but it was well worth it because we got a table right next to the river. So we got to check out the river as we were eating. It was delicious. The little guy got into some sugar or something because he is on a good one right now. So we just found a free boat that goes on the other side, which is Bullhead, Arizona. And there's pretty much nothing to do here. So it looks like all the employees that work at the casinos live in Arizona and they just cross on the boat and they go to work over there. So it is free. So if you guys want to come check it out, there's not too much stuff to do that I seen. So, but it's cool that we got to go over here and it was free. Mm -hmm. So something Some free nice to rice. do. Yes, nice ride, some free to do in Laughlin, Nevada. If you're looking for the free boat ride, it's right on the dock of the Riverside Casino. Okay, we are now at the Harris Casino and all the self parkings that we've gone to so far this trip, which is like five, it has been no cover. So free self parking when you come down here to Laughlin, Nevada. If you guys wanna to come to a beach in the middle of Nevada, come to the Harris Casino because they got a beach right here but you are supposed to have a Harris key don't tell nobody we kind of snuck on but you are supposed to have a key if you want to come down to the beach If you come all the way down to Watercraft Rentals, you could get a Sea-Doo for $89 for the first hour, and then you could do all day for $400. And it's located all the way in the farthest end of the Harris Casino in the beach area. So all the hotels here are on the river except for the Tropicana. So if that's a deal breaker, do not book your hotel at the Tropicana. We are currently at the Edgewater pool and it's uh, okay. Nothing too much to uh, write home about, but- Nothing crazy. Yeah, nothing crazy. But I felt like the Harris had uh, the nicest pool 
and it also has the beach so i recommend that one if you're all about going to the pool or you know you're gonna go to the water which one do you like aquarius yeah that Why? one's like nicer i liked it it was pretty nice we walked by it and it looked like everybody was having a good time they had the canopies up i guess you could rent those out yeah. get drinks have mm -hmm. fun by the pool and it did look nice mm -hmm. i like that one if you guys are coming to Laughlin, Nevada with kids, I recommend the Riverside Hotel and Casino because they have a bowling alley, they have arcades for the kids, and they even have their own movie theater. So I definitely recommend it if you're bringing kids to Laughlin. Thank you guys for checking out the video. If you liked it, give it that like, subscribe, any comments or questions down below, and we will get back to you, and we will see you guys on the next video. Bye-bye.